And you're back at Martin Stadium in Pullman, and you're watching the bull in the ring. Greg Heister, Ryan Leaf. Well, I, I, I suspect they're going to run. And, they do. And, and, and what a great draw call there by Coach Lutz. Hey, you know, they are almost last year. Later in the game at some time, he is dressed today, even battling an ankle injury. Fourth down, Gordon is flush. He's got room to run, throws it. Passes caught down to the 16 yard line goes Kelvin Jackson number 85. We've seen Mike Leach do many different things and usually throw the football. And Gordon dumps it off and it's a touchdown by number 84 Cassidy Woods who's had a big spring for Washington State. New three year contract for him. Tinsley with time going deep. And touchdown to Renard Bell. And it's 7 6. And you see the backflip. Get, get, get those. Get your yayas out now, <laughs> Renard. Player, keep the, keep the hands off the face mask, though. Great job. Great catch. Jackson, his third catch of the game. This one goes for a touchdown. The two Washington State students and services here on, on our Pullman campus. So we're excited to give them that check. See the catch there by Renard Bell with a nice move to keep that alive, and he gets it out near midfield. I want to build something here, and you look at the final four. I mean, you got a bunch of guys playing for each other. Tony Bennett's a better, great example. Gordon nice. goes to the end zone, and it's a touchdown to Travell Harris. First right over <laughs> Martin Stadium. Second and 11. Gordon steps up. Now he throws it. He's got a receiver, and is out of bounds with the catch is Travell Harris. He the gray and the crimson He's got the ball again but this time that Cougar defense and look who it is Nambi is going to make an impact this year now in his final year for Washington State I see it it was Josh Watson number 65 here's third down and 20 ball away tipped and it is intercepted on that far side yes I believe it is Tinsley little trouble with the snap he to the end zone Receiver is there. They're going to call interference on. They are. Tay flag Martin. is down as well. But they're going to call it on Tay Martin. So, uh, Tinsley now. Trey Tinsley on the field as quarterback. It's third down and three. He's got time to throw. Receivers are covered. Now he runs it and he's still loose at midfield. And Tinsley showing some wheels and he's touched down at the 42 yard line. And, and, and get the holding call. So the touchdown called back by Borgie. Here's the throw over the middle, a catch and run. Move to the inside, down to the five yard line goes number 81, Renard Bell. It's for the what? For the defensive back. Give up the middle. <laughs> Borgie's in there. Harris in motion. Cooper to throw, steps up. Ball on the way, and it is picked off on that far side. <laughs> Competition started, so they're going to get a chance to really see it and, and see how it plays out come August. Catch and run now by Desmond Patman, still on his feet and pushed out of bounds or forced out of bounds. At a yeah, and the ability for Washington State to get him and put him in a position to is that in interception? It was tipped and it is picked off by Tyrese Ross, number one. Funny, I assume. Like Oregon, um, they've lost three coaches to Oregon in the last uh, three years, and yet they continue to beat Oregon and compete at a high, high level. And there's a touchdown pass to number 88, Roderick Fisher. Fourth and five. Going deep. Press no safety help. And what a great catch. Now looking to stick one in the end zone. Here's the handoff to the left side. And I believe that's a touchdown. There's the late call to Tomanico. Dominic scores for the Crimson. 